Hello everybody, I'm Michael Gray, also known as Argolfumph, and today I'm playing Grim Tales The Vengeance. Aunt Gray, it's me, your nephew, James. It's Elizabeth. She's gone, and... This is so hard. They think I killed her. Aunt Gray, you know me. I wouldn't do this. Please, I need your help. I am playing this game because the main character is Ms. Gray, and I am Michael Gray. So I have the same last name as the main character. That's basically the only reason why I'm playing this game. So we have a trial here. I've got a paperclip. I am bending the paperclip because apparently that's a fun thing to do. And let's take a look at this. It is a hearing of the murder of Elizabeth Mc... McGray... McGray? What? Why is it Elizabeth Gray if they're related to me? Huh. Well, anyway, we need, we need to defend our nephew who has been accused of killing our niece. And I just broke my suitcase key. Why did I do that? I don't know, but uh, at least I've got my paper clip here. So this is a picture of us when we were younger. Oh, James was such a cute little kid. And I'm a detective. And yeah, I've got a subpoena. Cool. So let's get inside the courtroom. Entrance into the courtroom is restricted to participants in the trial. You have a subpoena? I certainly do, sir. It's right over here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, I should have recognized you at once, Miss Gray. I'm honored to meet you. This must be so hard for you, losing your knees and now her brother's accused of the murder. They say people will do anything for a fortune, but this? My heart goes out to you. Here we are. Please, come in. Alrighty, is James guilty of murdering his sister? Probably not. So what am I doing here? I'm... I'm... Clicking on the judge? Ms. Gray, your reputation precedes you. Your ability to pick up the memories of key objects will serve us well in this case. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Judge Adderley, and this is Mr. Kendall, the prosecuting counsel. This is Mr. Johnson, counsel for the defense. As you know, your nephew James has been charged with the murder of his sister Elizabeth. He pleads not guilty. Your role is not to judge the case, but to provide us with insight. We've collected physical evidence for you to peruse. Use whatever best gives you connection to the case. Fortunately, none of these people suspect that, you know, I'm somehow, you know, wh 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 what's that term? A biased witness. You think I would be a biased witness because, you know, I know both of the people, I, 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 I know the victim and uh, the defendant personally. You think I would be thrown out of court just because of that. But maybe I should be thrown out of court because I am not good at solving hidden objects challenges, which is what we have here. This is a challenge where you find everything that is listed at the bottom of the screen. And that's a hint button. It slowly refills. Once it refills all the way, I'll be able to use it to figure out where one of these items are located. And I'm picking up a pencil. Okay, here we go. Hint says this is a thing. That is an earring. Okay. And what else do we have here? Can I talk to the prosecutor? No. What about the defense attorney? No. Doesn't look like I can talk to anybody or do anything besides just solve the hidden objects challenge. So let's let's find these hidden objects. I need to find a fingerprint and a statute and a razor blade. What's a razor blade? Oh, ooh, and there's this thing again. Wait, I put it here to get the magnifier. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay, there's the Resor Blade. Yes. And, um... I need a tooth and a finger fingerprint. Fingerprint and a tooth somewhere. Well, whoever prepared all this evidence, they clearly did not do a very good job. It's all thrown everywhere. It's a huge mess. Oh, they, there. There's a tooth. And the magical piece of evidence I found was... Aw, oh, that's Elizabeth. Poor Elizabeth. The magical piece of evidence I found was the castle photo. And now, I'll use my psychic powers to time travel into the photograph. Yes, so this this is it. I am here um, on the night of the murder inside the photograph. Whoa. That looks like Elizabeth fighting with James. Ooh, man, James, not, not good. You fought with your sister on the night she was killed? Oh, dear. Okay, I found a... a what? An evidence, evidence. If one of the heirs should die, the entire estate shall be awarded to the surviving heir without the land. It wasn't long before James and I found our parents' legacy plans. I was first in line to inherit, with James after me. I can't say whether or not it was fair, but it was my parents' wishes. Yeah, that's not fair. That is not fair at all. I'm a member of the family. I should stand to inherit something. And okay, so it looks like I'm going to find five pieces of evidence, then we're going to make some sort of deduction? I think that's what the game is saying. Okay, so I'll keep my eye out for evidence, but mostly I'll keep my eye out for puzzles I can solve. Something in the roses... This is... That's a, that's a thing. This is a handle. This is a blade that needs a handle. And the handle's fallen off of there. All of the handles in this house are misplaced. And I see we need some keys. And here in the back we have a, a very rusty door. We have a lion, a missing zipper pull, and the lock goes there for a key. Where that key gets used. I haven't actually seen a star thing. Oh, right, I have. It's right here. Haha. -ha. Okay, that gives me a broken ruler. Hmm. Looks like I need to find something in order to fix the ruler. Bracing that. And this kettle is way too hot to touch, and that oil could be useful. Okay, let's go back outside. You've gone too far. You must be stopped. What the? Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. How is there something else in this magical frozen time travel world? Well, that's not good, and it started a fire. Uh, that's, that's not good at all. Okay. I need something sturdy to pry that up. And I need... Something to saw this board. Probably a saw. I bet I put this swan here next to the other swan. And that gives me the saw I need. Beautiful. Saw open the door for a bucket. Didn't I need a bucket to collect something in? I did. Uh, the dripping oil. And I have a brush. Cleaning off the spider webs, I imagine. Hmm, this needs the handle. Alright, that cleans off the faucet, and I can carry water here. Ooh, maybe I use the bucket here. Okay, so I'm all finished with that particular swan fountain. You can tell because I can no longer zoom into the fountain. That's a nice feature of the game. The game doesn't want me to go here right now... 
Oh wait, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use the bucket of water to put out the fire. So let's see, I don't think I can go right back inside yet. I need to solve a puzzle. Whoa. This, this is a puzzly puzzle. What is this? It looks like it's a jigsaw puzzle. Aha, there we go. And it looks like when you get a piece in place, it, it snaps into place and can no longer be moved. Great. So that should help us solve this puzzle. And there's a skip button. Um, you can skip the puzzle if you really feel like uh, feel like it. But I'm I'm not gonna skip this puzzle. I bet I can solve it on my own. I'll be a puzzle master today. There we go. So I'm kind of starting with the outside edges. You can see how the outside edges have rounded pieces. So that helps a lot. There also appear to be, um, let me see, skin-colored pieces over here, uh, underneath the girl's uh, head. This must be Elizabeth, the victim. Let's see, that goes there. That goes there. This must be her other arm. Alright, puzzle solved! I want to use a hint um, just to make sure I haven't missed anything here, and the hint button says there's nothing for me here, so let's, let's go to the foyer right now. So I picked up some items. Zipper, I needed a zipper... Well, okay, I needed a bucket for here, right? No, it appears I threw away my bucket, so I can't use it again. Well, that's not a very smart move on my part. Let's use the zipper here. It gives me a key and part of a scissors. Now, where did I need the key? I'll just use a hint to remind me that the key goes over here. Also, what is this thing? I, I noticed this. This is Silver McGray. Our ancestor, who was obsessed with money and gained his r gained his wealth by fraud and deception. Huh. Why are we keeping a statue of our horrible ancestor? And what's this? Yeah, I'm going to guess the evil person who's hiding in Elizabeth's room is the true culprit. And here's Austin McGray. He was infamous for his short temper. Here is a statue of him trying to hit a maid on the head because she spilled his cup of tea. Wow, we made a statue of our ancestor's most embarrassing moment and we keep it on display for us to always remember. We're a horrible family. No, 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 really. Really, it looks like we are. Oh, I need something to push this up. I think I need to fix the stick, and then I'll be able to uh, push that thing up. James. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Use masking tape to fix the stick. So we can flip that up. And this gives us a hidden objects challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Let's see. This... This looks like it goes there. Whoa, and that opens up a lot of different items. That statuette looks lonely. Well, here's a girl statuette. Aw, and now they're a married couple. Well, that's cute. So let's see, I also need to find a fly swatter and a mini plunger. Can't use a hint yet. This is a tie. Pincushion, wrench, and a fly swatter. I'm sorry if I'm 
doing badly. Oh, hey, there's a there's a strategy guide here. I didn't realize this. Okay, so maybe the strategy guide has pictures of where all the hidden objects are. Maybe. I think I might have jumped a bit too far ahead. I, I am not here yet in this game. Here? Okay, so one, two, three. So we've got three items down there. One, two, three. Must have gotten the third one already. Okay, so that, that definitely helps. There's the pin cushion. And there's the fly swatter. So I'll just use a hint to find the final item. And if we have any more hidden objects challenges, I'll think about using the guide. For now, we have a wrench. A wrench. And that should help us open this. Wrenchy! And I need to fix this leaky pipe. Oh, wait, more evidence. James has loved dogs ever since he was a little boy. But I was always afraid of them. We're so different sometimes. It's hard to believe we're brother and sister. James learned to use a dog whistle, and his dogs obeyed him well. There was a young girl who used to laugh when he used his command voice. Okay, so there's an evil dog, and apparently James's command voice was not very commanding. We need to figure out a way to fix the, the leaky pipe so we can get the domino. Apparently we're going to have a domino puzzle. That's a crown, and we need to fix the door. We'll do that after we finish fixing. Hmm, the crown is broken. Okay. We'll fix the door, but first we are fixing those, those scissors. I need something else to start the mechanism. Whoa. Shadow. Hint, is there anything here that I missed? Hint says yes. Hint says I missed something here. I don't know exactly what I missed. I need something to patch the leaky pipe. The crystal? I don't believe I have anything here that will patch the leaky pipe. Let's use the hint again. Oh, I'm using scissors on the carpet. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Oh, and there's another domino. So I imagine this is the thing that fixes the clock, the, the pendulum. And that trophy looks like it goes here. The neck of the bottle is too narrow for my hand, and coffee is delicious. Looks like I'll need a screwdriver. It's something long and thin for me to reach inside that little tiny bottle. So that gives us oil, and I imagine the oil goes over here to get rid of the rusty lock. Wow, this is a complicated thing. Yeah, uh, well, this is where our dominoes go. We still need to get the final domino. And the hint button says I'm doing something here. I'm maybe cutting this. A lion head. Perfect for the lion head thing. Not not there, but here. Oh, I need a third one, it looks like. Okay, so I need a third one. And the hint says, now I'm outside. Oh, <laughs> well, the third lion head was right there underneath some leaves. Well, that was... That's silly of me not to notice that myself. And this gives me a cork. Beautiful. Cork. And that gives me the next domino. Let's solve this domino puzzle. So what's this puzzle? Place all the dominoes and the ends so they form a figure eight. They must match the items. Okay, they have to match the items. So something like this, lion to lion to wolf, to wolf to bear. Let's say that's a bear. So, hmm, 
This is tricky. So three three things are touching elephant. Yeah, three things must touch elephant. Can this possibly touch elephant? So I think what you have to do is um, just get things in place. Rotate this piece? Huh. I'm gonna skip this puzzle. It seems to have completely confused me. So we're here in the trophy room. Oh! Bear scare! And another statue of one of our people. He was a hunter! One day he shot somebody. Okay, yeah, we continue to have statues of embarrassing moments in our family history. Okay. And that's a handle. Didn't I have a knife somewhere that needed a handle? What is hidden behind the secret door in the trophy room? I don't know, the trophy room was very well protected and the lock was super rusty so we know nobody has been in here recently. So I don't know why anything could be hiding here. Hint. Hint says we're going back there. There's the knife that needed a handle. This is the thing that needs to be cut. can't take the cork out, it's stuck. Well, I'm gonna need a corkscrew. And I have a metallic feather now, as well as an oven mitt. So I imagine the oven mitt is grabbing something which is very, very hot, like this. And the hot kettle, I imagine, is gonna melt this ice here. Giving me a pair of tongs. Still need a shell for that. I need a way to carry the fire. I'm gonna use a hint here, I don't quite understand what I'm doing. Oh, so I don't need a cork. I actually corkscrew, I need just the pair of needle nose pliers. Okay. Okay, that makes sense now. Uh, powder flask probably over here because we're making bullets. Why are we making bullets? This seems dangerous. Ah, it's for the for this gun over here on the left. Okay. Metallic feather. Perhaps I could put this stick in here for a handle. No? I can't use a hint quite yet, which is not good because I'm kind of stuck here. So... Wait until the hint is full. What? Okay. Mission accomplished. I take this weapon and I vow to protect my land from anyone who dares attack it. I'm sure James will never forget the day Father gave him his gun. My brother was never happier. James vowed to always protect our family. It's an old-fashioned sentiment, but my family values tradition. Yeah, all the evidence I'm finding makes James look like a guilty, guilty culprit. Am I supposed to be defending him or not? Either way, I have a gun and a target. So let's just shoot this thing open. And this gives me a hidden objects challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. So let's see, where is our latest hidden objects challenge? Okay, so we have one, two... I can't really memorize more items than that in a row. One, two, three, four. Then it's gonna be five, six, seven, eight, nine. Something five, six, seven, seven, eight, and a nine. 
Where did the tobacco go? Here it is. So the other items were this to there, and then stuff. This to there. some sort of fancy achievement award. Yay! So the sun, as I recall, goes over here. Ah, but I need a moon thing. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else I could do. It'd be nice if I had a screwdriver. But I don't. I have ice tongs. Maybe I can grab this. Shell handle. I know where that goes. That goes over here. That's the corkscrew, which I <laughs> thought I needed, but apparently did not. Oh, wait, I can use it here, too. That gives me the moon. Beautiful. Now I'm here in the dark. You better leave this place. While you still can. Culprits! Who are you? Show yourself. Evil monster, why are you hiding in Elizabeth's room? What are you doing? Looks like I'm collecting stuff, too. I need a special emblem. As soon as I finish that, uh, I mean, as soon as I fix this crown, I imagine I'll be able to use it. Mm, looks like Elizabeth's room is just filled with garbage. Elizabeth. Elizabeth, clean up your room, girl. And, uh, there's a dollhouse. Let's go to the dollhouse. Nancy Drew apparently is looking for stuff in the dollhouse. What? That is the Nancy Drew silhouette. What is going on here? Um... I... I... What? Does this go here? Okay. Puzzle. Sort all the accessories by returning them to the correct... Houses, dolls, okay, there we go. I pull this, I want to give the accessories to the right people. Okay, that doll's holding a crown. I need to find a doll who's not holding something. I'm so confused. Okay, dolls can only hold one accessory at a time. Okay, maybe this woman isn't holding something? Does anybody understand how to solve this puzzle? Because I don't. Um, let's take a look at what the strategy guide has to say. The strategy guide says I'm solving hidden objects challenges, actually. Okay, so number one, I'm taking yellow and moving it to that doll. Okay. Okay, that works. So this is rough because I can see which things go with which dolls mostly. What was number two? Number two is that, to that, to that. Fan? to this doll. Pigtails on that doll. Man and wife. Crown on this doll, perhaps? So I can give wing to this doll. So I can give balloon to the boy. And the dog to the bone. The bone to the dog. And that gives me... A fancy smancy prince. Woohoo. 